Good morning my friends, my name is Fabri and today we finally have some descriptions of LEGO Star Wars 2016 summer sets. Few weeks ago I made a video with some guesses, an hypothesis that turned out to be quite accurate. We got this updated and new information from London Toy Fair, because you know, the pictures are not allowed. So hopefully we will see them tomorrow from Nuremberg Toy Fair or from New York later in the winter. As soon as I will find some, I will give you guys my impression, so make sure to go Kylo Ren on the subscribe button. Without further ado, let's go straight to the list. So let's start with some of my favorite ones. The Clone Turbo Tank. The last one was from 2010, so 6 years to get the new one. Who has seen the set says that the suspension are quite improved. We have a great selection of minifigs. A Clone Scout Trooper, maybe from the Kashyyyk Battle Pack of 2014. Commander Gree, probably the same of the ATTP. I will really hope to get a translucent stud with maybe Darth Sidious, you remember the Order 66, that will be quite awesome. And then we get two new Jedi's, Luminar and Dooley, we haven't seen her in a long long time, maybe from the Wookiee Catamaran 2005. And Queen Lambos was in Clone Wars with Obi-Wan Kenobi and in LEGO we had it in the Republic Frigate, but it was the Clone Wars version so it will be quite different. The price seemed to be quite legit for such a big set. Then we have the ATT from Star Wars Rebels, it is confirmed this set will be really really great. Three clone commanders, Rex, Wolf and Gregor. Of course they are quite old because in the mission Ezra goes on a lost planet to find some old Republic general. But we never got Wolf in phase 2 armor, there are some custom minifigs but we never got it from the official LEGO group. So so it will be awesome. Everything is awesome. The ATT should be the same as the last one, you know, the Genosis one. But this one will be very old, damaged and rusty, like in the Star Wars Rebels episode. I can't wait to review it. Then we go to the Force Awakens sets with Jakku Encounter. It will be a mix between the scene where Rey trades her metal junks in exchange for meals and the scene where BB-8 is captured by a native and Rey frees him. Or we, not sure. We will get Ankar Plat, which is a big alien. It's kind of the what of Jakku. It's pretty big and we will see how Lego will make it. Then of course we get Ray and finally a cheap BB-8. Tido with a brick build Loga Beast and a Jakuta. It's quite expensive, 50 pounds. There will be definitely Honkar Plat market, but I was hoping we got also Ray's home. Do you remember in the foot of the 8080? It would have been very, very nice. Always from Star Wars 7, we have Resistant X Wing Fighter. And now we have the confirm that it's from the opening scene on Jakku, when the First Order destroys all the population. We will finally have Poe without his orange pilot suit and black helmet. This one surely has his leather jacket and blue and white helmet. I am hoping that the X-Wing will have some differences from the previous one, like a blaster cannon that Poe uses to shoot the First Order trooper. It will be quite cool. Then of course we get BB-8 and the flame trooper. And then the most anticipated minifigure, Lord Santeca, the old man that, spoiler alert, gives to Po the USB drive with the secret map to find Luke Skywalker. Again from Rebels, we have the Darth Vader ties advanced. We had a lot of remaking of this vehicle from, I don't know, 2003. There will be Sabine and also an A-Wing with his pilot and Darth Fanner. It's quite curious if we will have Darth Fanner with his new Rebels molded helmet. It's uh, quite a longer face. Or the one from the Dead Star Duel that can open in two pieces. We can get also Moff Tarkin. In the end we have two other set from Star Wars IP. I don't know exactly what it is. It's probably a new show, kind of Yoda Chronicle thing. But we will see. The sets, uh, by the way, are not so expensive. So that's all for now. If I will get my hands on the pictures, I will make another video as soon as possible. So go Kylo Ren on the subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao! Lions roaring in the morning sun Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come we must never stop the way